I already knew that I loved Antipodes masks and the Flora Probiotic is now a staple in my skincare collection. It just feels so incredible on my skin, especially now that the winter is coming and it's getting a bit colder. I've had real red breakouts and kind of blotchiness and some breakouts all on my like jawline. And this just soothes them instantly and really helps my overall complexion to be calm. It has like a lavender scent and sort of like a gel texture that doesn't ever fully dry on your skin. So it still has like a tacky feeling. I've been using it twice a week. I would love to use it more, but I'm trying not to use it up too quickly. But yeah, I can see the difference straight away after using it. My skin just feels like it's had a nice comforting hug. This has definitely got instant results for redness. Like it's calmed down any red skin straight away. For my blemishes, it did take about a week. So using it twice to clear any blemishes. I will say actually, since I've been using this, I haven't had any of those really big, painful hormonal breakouts. And I normally get one or two every month. And yeah, I've not actually had one since using this mask. So that's been a real result. As you can see, I use the new antibodies mask flora with probiotics quite a lot. My aim was to use it once a week. I did end up using it a bit more. My tip is do not use as much as you would with a normal cream because it feels a bit heavy and a bit itchy on a sensitive skin. What I really liked about this mask is the fragrance and the feel of my skin after I used it. I felt that I need to use it more on the days that my skin was really stressed or red because at the end it felt more soothed and back to normal. And what I really like about this mask is the color, the fragrance and the fact that it's so pink like my jacket. I loved using this mask this month. It's been really great to use alongside the Kiehl's Retinol I've also been trying this month because it's really good for like sensitive skin. It's really soothing. It's also really plumping. So even when my skin's fine, I feel like I can use it. I've used it as an overnight mask and I wake up and my skin is just really smooth and plump. And yeah, I love it. This is the Flora mask, which is part of their probiotic range. When I was looking at this and I picked it up, I was thinking, God, Charles, you haven't used it a lot. Like it looks like you've barely tried it, but I've been using it at least once a week. I literally keep it next to my toothbrush and whenever I get out of the shower, I'll pop it on and then go upstairs and mince around for a bit and then follow up with the rest of my skincare because it's one of those masks that can literally be used left on and not bring your skin out. It's very, very surprising how it makes your skin feel soft, clearer. I've noticed my pores look less big as well, which is interesting. When I was looking at the list of what was new and I saw this, it made me realize that people see face masks as something you should buy or get when you've got a problem, but that's not what it should be at all. This is a preventative. It's also something just to maintain balance throughout your skin throughout the week, throughout the month. And it's something I genuinely wouldn't be without now. Lovely pink color. It's a really relaxing lavender scent. It's literally like a lavender pillow. Enjoyed using it. I feel like a mask like this should be in everyone's skincare routine just to keep your skin nice and healthy and plump in between. Highly recommended.